I apologize if I'm sounding a bit mature today. R reality is, I just woke up and I'm sick. Also, my throat is a mess. It literally hurts when I speak up. But th the main problem is, I don't even know what to title this video. It's kind of like a follow-up. <coughs> slash update slash responding to comments slash new mic test slash a fix but i don't think we can call it a proper fix because i'm not sure if it fixed what it's supposed to fix or i fixed what is supposed to be fixed but hey don't get me wrong i, I thought this update was going to be special i, I, I hope this was a, a special case but no it it's not a special case it's just a normal case that we see in paladins with each update so <clears throat> Let's start from the beginning, right? Back in December when everyone was busy talking and making content about Tiberius as fast as possible so they can appeal to the furry community and get extra views and traffic, I wasn't feeling it. Usually new champions are hyped up to the max, but then they end up as just another champion, you know, a week or two after their release, except for Maeve. Instead, I was like, hey, Let's talk about something that is completely irrelevant. I was so excited for that video, mainly because I was gonna call out the Strix mains on their bullshit. In the same time, I was gonna defend this cute ass bitch. I woke up very early in the weekend and I sit on my PC and I'm so motivated. Hell yeah, I'm gonna work so hard on this video. There isn't gonna be a minute for rest. I won't eat, I won't drink, I won't shit, I won't beat my dick. It's gonna be focus on top of focus. But then I remember this is Paladins that we're talking about. Yep. Do you know how it feels when you're so passionate and motivated about doing something and having people spam you to make uploads, but Paladins hits you with all sorts of fuckfest? It's heartbreaking! Now, to be honest, I started experiencing these issues back in August or July, I'm not sure. What I am sure of, it was the IO update. IO, I already hate you for the fake bitch that you are, but now that I realize you brought these problems with you, I, I hate you even more. Goddess of the moon, more like like hoe of the moon but hey uh to be fair it, it was pretty low key back then like i can barely remember it happening but the more time went through the more paladins became frustrating that one sniper's video that's where paladins crossed the damn line i couldn't even play a proper match my guy i get stuck on loading vendors uh, by the way a pro tip if it doesn't get you nowhere in three to five minutes this means it will go on forever from there so you're better off closing paladins and starting from the beginning now i have to launch task manager then launch paladins you know just in case i need to close paladins but it wasn't just that the entire game was delayed i couldn't even join a match and when i do join a match it's hell all right the fps uh, uh, the, 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 uh, the fp who the fuck is responsible for this how did we even get here this shit makes zero sense if you look at my older videos i had none of these problems actually some of those videos were in 60 fps and i had a shitty pc back then hand to god it was like a 180 dollars computer but still no problems whatsoever now that i have a fucking gtx 6060 ti i get 40 fps <coughs> I swear to god, I'm gonna fucking die. So yeah, of course I was gonna make an entire video bitching about it and god damn, I was mad. I was an angry kid yelling at a screen at 2am. I didn't give a fuck what the feedback was going to be. I just wanted my shit fixed. But hey, uh, let's talk about the feedback. 25% of the comments were people saying they had this issue or have this issue. Another 25% was saying, LOL, it's just you. And 50% was telling me to go play Overwatch. Jesus Christ. Check out 0 2 over here not one not two not three four five six seven eight nine ten ten comments telling me to play overwatch you piece of shit bitch ass zero two though i want to talk about these in particular just because you never had a girlfriend in your entire life doesn't mean girls don't exist uh, uh, wait that doesn't make sense you understand what i'm saying right exactly Maeve sucks major day. When you come around and say this issue never exists and this entire video is pointless, you are normalizing the problem, which is the last thing people like me want. Now, Evil Mojo is gonna see clowns like you and use them as an excuse. <laughs> hey, these guys don't have any problem, right? Right? Yeah. <laughs> yes. This means it's only you, Adrix. It's, it's only you. Don't listen to this video. 
These problems are not real. They're fake. <laughs> They're fake. You just keep playing the game. Just keep playing the game. Like everything is fine. Furries. 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 Why are people praising him? Laughing emoji. It's obvious that only Indians and people with bad tech and internet have this. Just because this issue is uncommon for now, doesn't mean they don't have to take a look at it. When your paladins is being unplayable just for you, and you look up fixes about your situation, and you don't find any solutions, of course you're gonna feel left out and lost, but then you see some YouTuber make a video on it, obviously you will support what he said and take his side. Like the fuck you mad about. There are people who didn't even watch half of the video, but they still went ahead and said it's only you. But can I say something? Something about the internet like uh, okay okay mister thank you it won't take long I, I promise I remember upgrading my internet at the start of 2019 and it became eight times better than it was before and even with that bad internet I was able to play paladins now jump to August the new improved internet is not enough to play paladins what the proof that my internet isn't the issue was in the damn video why do you think I went out of my way and asked Asked my friend to give me his origin account so I can specifically test Battlefield 5, a game that requires a good latency. You just can't have a bad internet and play a Battlefield game. But uh, according to some assholes, my internet isn't strong enough to load a massive game like Paladins. The map in Battlefield 5 is huge, and in this map, you have all sorts of weird shit your internet has to load. You have people shooting, you have people sniping, you have Bob the Builder, you have medics reviving, you have planes exploding your dick off from the sky, you have unrealistic female representation but sadly my internet isn't strong enough for the scale of a game like paladins at that moment i was waiting for the new update to see if it fixes all these issues and i had all the confidence in the world that both my internet and pc have nothing to do with this until one of my friends was uh, watching paladins on mixer but while he was on there he spotted podzer when podzer was asked about my video he did say it's because of my internet that broke me i was like oh shit maybe it is true maybe i've been acting like a dick for no reason maybe the problem is only coming from me maybe i was wrong 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 Bitches, I ain't fucking wrong. Before we move on to the actual problem that caused this, I have to thank everyone who was trying to help me and offer me solutions in the hope of fixing my game. Both Discord messages and long ass YouTube comments, I read all of them and I tried some of them. Now, fast forward to the current update. Did season 3 fix Paladins? Eh. I only played for the first two days of the update. The first day had a pretty strong start. Loading vendors was pretty much instant. And by that I mean two to three minutes. This might might seem strange for you, but to me, I see this as an absolute win. When I played my first matches, I was like, hey, something is wrong. The delay is gone! But sadly, that was not the case. Turns out, the more matches I play, the more delay I get. But then, day 2 comes in, and gosh, it's... I don't even wanna go through it. It was just a worse experience than day 1. The delay was much more present, and it was a bigger delay in general. I was crashing more often. But the next day, me and my weep friend wanted to record a thing for my Tiberius video. But that thing requires us to switch accounts, so I give him my password, and he gives me his. I typed that shit up and holy Vivian ties. I, 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 I don't even I don't even know from where to start. The, the, the FPS is locked into 100, 175 all the fucking time, which I, I, I suppose it's the, the maximum amount of, of, of FPS you can get. The delay was non-existent. I was loading into matches faster than fast, quicker than quick. Loading vendors? Who the fuck is that? It was simply a much more stable experience, although I wish my friend could say the same. To him, he was facing all sorts of problems. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, we got him. This entire time, it wasn't my computer, it wasn't a virus or malware, it wasn't my internet, it was my account 
all along. Now, how could this happen? Well, we have a little theory that is not confirmed, but after seeing the results, it's legit, at, at least in my eyes. All of this mess is related to your friends and the amount of friends you have. Just to let you know, all the information I have is based on other people's thoughts, theories, and tests. You see this little thing, right? We're gonna call it the delay meter. And for each check mark, we get a point. Do I have friends from Xbox, PlayStation, the Switch? Yes. Do I have a lot of Steam friends that play Paladins and have their account linked to Steam? Yes. Yes. Do I have five stack a party? Yes. Do I have a lot of friends in general? Well, yes, a lot. Like a lot. Like like multiple a lot. Like like a lot of a lot. 700 to be precise. The next thing I did was deleting about 200 of those friends. And not gonna lie, it's much better now. The FPS is fixed, at least for most matches. The delay doesn't happen as much. I don't think I've crashed once. It's been almost 20 days. But each day I make sure to delete more and more friends. And come on, Evil Mojo. Come on. Come, come, fix this, please. Yeah, you can't force me to delete all my friends. have any clue how many of these are e-girls that supply me with living expenses? Probably like one or two. Hundred. Look, I understand if you don't have the budget for it, but if you're aware that having a lot of friends can fuck up your paladins, why didn't you set up a limit to the amount of friends you can have? This whole mess could have been avoided. So again, <clears throat> to sum this up, paladins punishes you for having friends, because when your account is trying to connect to the paladin servers, it also has to keep track of your friends' activity. The more friends you have in multiple platforms, the more your account is gonna struggle to connect to the servers. And one of my friends told me that the game tweets friend request as actual friends because when you try to invite a friend you will be able to see friend requests so it doesn't matter if you accepted them or not as long as they sent you a request and they are online they're gonna pop up in here this is as if someone knocked on your door and the door just opened by itself and let the person in it doesn't matter if you like them or hate them they're still going inside and you have to accept it like the little bit hopefully this video will go up in time so they can see this and maybe include some kind of a fix a, a lot of people are mad with the removal of kill cam or whatever but guys 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 shut the fuck up they said it's for the better they said it's gonna remove bugs yes this might encourage hackers to cheat more this might mean you won't be able to see how you got killed precisely but hey if it's gonna fix a large portion of bugs if it's gonna be worth it i'm all for it just like when a wise man once said a small price to pay for salvation have a better night than me Always been the one, yeah, that'll never change Bright like the sun, but real like the rain Yeah, your head stays numb, but your heart feels pain You wanna stay young, but you feel the time change And I know it sounds dumb, but I feel the same way I wanna be the one that can take away your pain Yeah, we could just run somewhere far away And never look back at the 